It's Rob Corpin with American RV and wanted to show you a couple things on the brand new Sabre 260 RLS. It's in the Silhouette series. Uh, one of the new floor plans for Sabre is 26 feet with the rear living room on it. As you can see, we've got a full-size spare tire, a ladder to go up to the roof. If you look at the roof, it's all crowned, so all the water will shed off to the sides. Plus, you have the extended drip spouts, which is a nice thing that will help reduce the black streaks. On this side, you notice it's a full-length awning that covers both doors. And you've got three steps to both doors as well. We have outside speakers on the awning side. The grab handles, they also do to both doors. A lot of manufacturers only do it for the main door. This is the door that goes right into the bedroom. Up in the front, you've got pass-through storage that goes all the way through. And you can see the aluminum framing also in there. Just underneath the trailer is a barbecue grill port or for LP gas that you can tap into there. You'll notice it's a very radius front, aerodynamic. You've got the nice decals, plus the diamond plate, which will help uh, keep the road debris off of it. Plus there's a light up here to help you hitch up at night. This is the other side of the storage. You've got a big cabinet there. On this side, you've got outside shower. That's hot and cold running water. There's a black tank sewer flush that spritzes out the, uh, the toilet tank and then fresh water connection and your city water connection and then all the valves are underneath there to empty the waste. Now we'll take a look on the, on the inside. inside and right when you walk in the door they have a nice control panel here. You've got a switch to control your electric awning, your slide room, this is for the water pump and these switches are illuminated. The water heater is gas and electric so you just flip the switch for those. This is the monitor panel for all of your tanks and then you've got all of your lights and you've got a lot of lights on the outside for the patio and the step light, both on the awning side and the other side of the trailer. Also, if you can see right up here, you've got a little key holder plus 12 volt connection with a little shelf up here uh, and a 110 for any chargers. When you come inside, you'll notice you got the two chairs in the back with the large window and the window is tinted and you've got the fabric shades with storage all the way across up here. And when you look over to this side, this is your slide room. You've got a high to bed sofa in here, which is the air bed. That top comes all the way over and inflates to a nice queen size bed. Plus there's storage underneath. The sofa is all freestanding too. So if you need to move it around or get something that dropped behind there, you can do that. We've got this one equipped with a booth in it that will fold down and make up to an additional bed. And the cushions just go right over top. Plus you have storage underneath there. We can also get that with a table and chairs. A 32 inch TV comes with it. You've got a DVD player, uh, iPod hookup, and you've got a memory card slot there too where you can play digital pictures. A little bit of storage for things on top. The big fridge with a panel door. There is a pantry here. A lot of 26 footers do not have a pantry. In the kitchen You've got a nice stove with a spark igniter. All of the drawers are full extension with a cutlery tray here. You've got a water heater bypass for easy winterizing. The sink is an undermount sink. Uh, it helps kind of increase your counter space a little bit. Plus you have a pull-out sink sprayer as well. And you have kitchen cabinets with shelves in them and a skylight right over top here which helps brighten up the kitchen area and there's a shade on there as well. Okay, you do have a door now into the bedroom and bathroom area that separates from the living area. Glass shower uh, with a skylight in there which helps brighten it up and the tub surround. It is all ducted air conditioning throughout the whole trailer and you can uh, open and close those vents. Some nice storage underneath. It is a, if you can see over here it's a porcelain toilet with a foot flush. You won't get any staining and a nice you know, cabinet for linens and uh, odds and ends, things like that. There's a hard door here too to close off the bedroom from the bathroom for privacy. In the bedroom you have storage underneath this bed plus your nightstands with outlets on both sides. 
Then on this side here too, on this side of the bed, there is a clothes hamper that you can shoot down to the pass-through storage, which gives you a place for the dirty clothes. Thanks for watching the video, and if you have any questions, please feel free to call us and stop by to take a look at the new savers. Thanks again.